Hi everybody, I'm John Canary, and I'm pretty excited about this three minute video that I'm kind of sending out to you here today. You know, Napoleon Hill, the great Napoleon Hill really, he said one time that all achievement, no matter what, what may be its nature or its purpose, he said it must begin with an intense burning desire for something definite. How about you? Do you have a deep burning desire for what it is you want, or do you just want something? Do you just want your results to automatically improve where you get up one morning and everything has happened? Well, that's not how it works. And I'm going to give you four basic principles that if you implement them beginning today, if you really focus on them and you take action on them, I promise you that deep burning desire will begin to develop. Because look at the very first principle. It's so important. It is called passion. Without passion, we're not going to do a whole lot. Passion, that love you have for something that you want to create, that love you have to kind of be better than you presently are, to do better than you presently are doing, that's passion. And the second principle, which is called focus, that's the ability to take what is called your passion and direct it towards something very, very specific. And of course, number three, and boy, I just love this one here. And it's the easiest one to kind of measure. It's where you're going to start to outwork the people beside you. If they go home at five, you go home at 10 after. If they turn out the lights at eight, you turn them out at 10 after. Just put that little bit of extra something into what it is you do and watch how you kind of move and flow just by other people. You know, I believe it was Roosevelt one time. He wanted to be the number one student at his university, at his school. And he worked hard at it. And that's the first quarter, at the end of the first quarter, guess what happened? He finished second. One night in his dormitory, as he was doing his studies, he noticed there was one light on in the whole complex. He made it his business to find out who that light belonged to. It was the guy who finished ahead of him, who finished first in the class. He made up his mind that when that man's light went out at night, he was going to study 15 minutes longer. And it was that 15 minutes difference that made all the difference. And in the next quarter, he actually finished in front of him. So just put in a little bit more than the guy beside you and see what happens. And of course, now, number four, two words, persistency and consistency. You see, if you're persistent in what you do, you're going to get there. If you're consistent in what you do, you're going to stay there. And those two words, you want to kind of make a big part of your life, persistency and consistency. Persistence is where you form the habit of persistence in your life. Consistency keeps those habits growing and working in your life every day. So put those four things to work starting today, and I'll see you in our next message. This is John Canary offering you the very best of everything.